What's up guys, and in today's video, yes, you saw the title in the thumbnail, right? We are playing Nuketown Zombies, but we have to pack a bunch every single gun that this map has to offer, and that is 32 guns. I know, insane. Now with the intro out of the way, let's get this on uh, track, really. Um, if you do enjoy this video, please make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. Because I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the year, and only you guys can make that possible. And huge shout out to the guy that put, that um, commented on last uh, video. He said that he hopes that I make it big. I hope so too, bro. I hope so too. <laughs> um, I will have to pop your username up on screen. It's just that I don't remember it. I do apologize. <clears throat> wow, what I've dropped here? Uh, quick revive. We're going to grab that. But there's 32 guns. As memory serves, Nuketown had 28 guns to pack a punch. If you want to watch that video, that video will be in the BO2 Zombies playlist. Yes, I finally made a BO2 Zombie playlist. Hooray! <clears throat> it only took me like two days to bloody do. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, and knife. I, okay, how the hell did I miss that knife? Because pack a punch, we literally need it. We're on round 12, and we still haven't gotten pack a punch. Now, I've never round 30 um, this map, so if we get to round 30 on this map, you know what you guys should do? I'm not, I don't even have to say it. <laughs> you guys know what you should do. The, the click-through rate of my videos are insane. You know what I saw, like, the other day? I was watching a video of uh, someone playing... Oh, what was it? Oh, that's right. I was watching mini golf, and they, and they said um, to subscribe, otherwise you wake up with like a spider on your face. And, you know what I thought? Initially thought that sounds like a good idea to say. I got a good line to say. And I'm like, no, nah, never mind. I don't. I don't want people to be like scared when they wake up. <laughs> Imagine that, like watching a video of someone saying, if you don't subscribe, you wake up with a spider on your face. You don't subscribe and you wake up with a spider on your face. That would suck. I, I, I know I would like literally just go, go to that video and type in the comments, you motherfucker. <laughs> I think that's a perk dropping or a uh, pack a punch. I'm hoping pack a punch because we need pack a punch really badly. I'm pretty sure that's pack. I'm hoping it's pack, so that'd be great. Please, zombie, move. I beg of you, please move. Thank you. Now, we will pack punch the uh, M1911 straight away so we can swap it out straight away. Okay, let's try and look for the thing that dropped. Oh, it was pack. Yes. Uh, we can pack a punch two guns. The M1911 B23R is now pack and punched. Uh, let's cross them off the list. It turns out we didn't even type, uh, put m 11 on the list, so I guess it's already crossed out, so. Oh, what a pistol, bro. I love this pistol. Hold on, give me a second. Let me just quickly take a screenshot of this pack-a-punch real quick. Use it as a thumbnail. Hold on one second. Uh, thumbnail acquired. Wait, hold on. Is it automatic? It's automatic. The This gun's automatic. Nah. Nah. <laughs> I didn't even know this. B23, I hope freaking... <laughs> turns automatic when it's pack-a-punched. That is hilarious. It's like the freaking RPG, but the RPG is more funner. Uh, if only it did more damage when, when you pack a punch it. You'll see why I love the RPG so much, because when you pack a punch the um, uh, RPG, it literally turns automatic, basically. Well, it is automatic. It shoots like 20 rockets. It is insane. Now, I haven't pack a punch this I don't think I've ever pack a punch. -ed. I forgot the gun's name again. I uh, will just call it the B34R, like it's uh, pack a punch name. We have never pack a punched this gun in our hands. Uh, we are training up the zombies so we don't waste ammo. Um, I know. I know I said I wouldn't train as much because I always die when I'm training. Oh my god, this gun just melts through ammo real quick. It's like the Cat 40. <laughs> the must thing in Sally is just. Uh, the Mustang and Sally is just a different breed, okay? It's really easy to down yourself with these guns. So do be careful and be mindful of your surroundings. Uh, let's uh, go and pack a bunch of another wall by weapon real quick. So what we're going to do is we're going to start from uh, this side of the map. The Remington is over here. So I'm guessing we're pack a punching the Remington. Yep, we're pack a punching the Remington. Okay, uh, let's swap out this one. Ramington it is. Uh, and the pack punch is on this side. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it is. Uh, let's pack a punch of Ramington for the very first time in our zombie's career. And that is a really long name. I'm not going to pronounce that in any way, shape, or form. No way. I don't want to embarrass myself. Alright. Uh, now we just got to save up 
points, so what we're going to do is we're going to quickly get the gun that's up here, because I know there's a gun up here somewhere. Uh, it is the Burst. Interesting. The M6, the Colt M16A1. Uh, this gun is... I don't even know if this gun's good. I mean, we're about to find out. <laughs> I'll probably use this as a point builder, so yeah, that's fun. Like, I know I shouldn't be drinking so much energy drinks, but like, you know, I like energy drinks, okay? So I'm gonna drink them. The one good thing that I, like, two things I've quit in my, in my, um, like, in my lifetime was smoking and drinking, like, alcohol. Like, I don't drink alcohol anymore at all. Like, I never drink alcohol or smoke. It's great. It's just, I feel so much better without it, you know? I'm not, I'm not always angry or always drained. Oh, my God. I'm pretty sure when it's gun packet punches, it gets an attachment where you can turn to, like, a grenade launcher. I'm pretty sure. I may be wrong about that. Did I say I, like, have never packet punched this gun before? I think that's a lie. I think I have packet punched this gun before. Okay, yeah, no, that's... Yeah, okay, that's, that makes sense. I shouldn't have done that. I really should have paid more attention. Okay, that's, yeah, that makes sense. I, yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm all out of sorts right now. Oh, no, we don't have, uh, shit, okay. No zombie is going to kill me. Not today, Junior. Not today. Jesus, do you see how fast that zombie was swinging, bro? Man's a freaking professional boxer. He was like, oh, come on, box, Come on, man. I'll freaking ring you in the box, bro. <laughs> freaking Jesus Christ. Psycho zombie. Oh, yeah. And who who do you think is going to win the fight between uh, Mike Tyson and Jake Paul? That's also another topic to really uh, touch upon. Like, I reckon it's going to be a hella good fight. Uh, we are going to be using the Remington now because it's round 15 and I really don't want to die. Dying will, is not on the list. And whatsoever. We've only packet punched. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot to cross out the Remington. Remington packet punched successfully. Do, do any of my viewers watch WWE? Because uh, I know a lot of people don't like WWE because they because it's scripted. I know the wrestlers still get hurt, and I reckon it's like really cool with the things they come up with, like uh, backward somersaults, like landing on people. It's just, it's the story the storytelling is just. It's really good. That's why I like WWE. UFC is also really good. Like, I watch every combat sports you could think of. Because it's just entertaining. Because I myself, I actually, one day, if I make it big, I want to actually um, get into the ring with someone. I don't know who. I'm not going to call out anyone. Um, because I'm not that big of, big of a YouTuber. And I don't know anything about boxing. All I know is to just duck and weave and punch back, basically. <laughs> I feel like... We should grab a like AR. Cause I feel like the Remington pack of punch is not getting getting us so, uh, that many points. This video is gonna take forever. I don't. I've probably said that multiple times in this video. I'm just not gonna say it anymore. I hope you guys have made some popcorn and are sitting back watching me suffer for the next two hours. Cause this is gonna take me two hours. Not joking. I've decided it's gonna take me two hours. Oh my god. I've literally speed collar and it's still taking me ten million years just to reload. That is insane. You know, double tap would be great right about now. Okay, so we're gonna go and uh, upgrade the uh, Colt M16 because we can go do that now. That's fun. I wonder actually how good this gun's gonna be when it's back punched. And then we're gonna swap out the Remington. I know that sounds like a really bad idea. If we go down, we still have one more quicker vibe left, so that's not too bad. I was right about the uh, the rocket launcher thing. Okay, cool. Uh, the Colt is crossed off the list. Now let's go and find the next gun to pack a punch. Uh, should we pack a punch the Olympia or go to the bus? Uh, the Olympia it is. We're gonna pack a punch the Olympia next. Oh, it, it turns automatic. That's not bad. I wonder how, how good the um, grenade launcher is. I'm not gonna test it though, cause I really don't wanna die. <laughs> Round 17, we've got like four guns back a punch, I think it was. The M16 turns automatic, interesting. And it also has a grenade launcher. Oh, let's test it out. Yeah, that's a bad idea. That was a bad idea. That was a terrible idea. That stun blocked me like crazy. I wonder how, how good the um, grenade launcher is. I'm not gonna test it though, cause I really don't wanna die. <laughs> the M16 has a decent amount of ammo, which is really good. And because it doesn't kill like really easily, it's a really good point, but uh, we've got 12,000. We can pack a punch the Olympia now. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Uh, Olympia pack a punch. Uh, let's cross that out. Olympia is now pack a punch. Let's go. Uh, and then we're gonna pack a punch. You know what? Yeah, let's pack a punch the M14. I wonder what round we'll get double tap, because we really need double tap. Alright, 
The M14 is now ticked off. <laughs> let's go. Uh, uh, let's see how quick it kills the zombie. Okay. That's not bad, actually. Ah, uh, let's keep on using it. Might as well. We're basically nearly uh, out of ammo with the skull. It's called Skull Crusher? Damn, that's a freaking great name for a gun. Holy shit. Uh, we have to pack a punch. Two more weapons. So one more weapon up there, and one more weapon down there. Then we can start hitting the mystery box for our weapons, which is great. It's good that we're getting all the wall buyers out of the way, because wall buyers are usually the weakest guns. I'm pretty sure my highest ever round on Call of Duty Black Ops 2 was with the Raygun Mark 2. We got to like round 34, 35. And it was uh, doing the pack a punch uh, challenge on town, which was great. I love this map. This map has given me double tap, which is really goddamn good. Okay, yeah, that skull crusher is my new favorite gun. I don't care what anyone else says, it's my new favorite gun. I'm pack a punch again every single time I play this map. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we need to grab a gun from. Oh, yeah, that's right. We need a pack a punch. What gun was it? It was this one. Yay. Okay, let's go and pack a punch this gun. We need to pack a punch it. Whilst it's pack a punch, we're going to cross it off the list. Okay, let's cross off the list. Oh, we got a scope. Let me pack a punch this gun. That's pretty good. But this gun shoots really goddamn quickly. How good. Uh, let's go see what gun is up here. Up on top area. Uh, let's see what gun's up here. It's the MP5. Okay, that's not bad. Wait, hold on. AK7FU2. <laughs> that's a funny name. I love that name. Whatever dev came up with that name, I, I honestly hope you got a raise for coming up with this name. Oh my god, what a name. Uh, we still haven't hit the mystery box to get uh, the other guns that we need. Yet again, I do think that we're going to have to do more than one run, which is going to suck. Come on, come on, get to the radio. Oh, that's bad. I, 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 yeah, I need to stop sick of that song. I don't want to get copyright claim. Okay, nah, nah. This is a whole destroyer, bro. You know, I should do a challenge on if I get hit by a zombie once, I restart the, like, challenge. Oh my fucking god! We got hit so many times during that freaking encounter, bro. Oh my god. Uh, let's go on. Pack a punch the MP5. And then we're done with all the wall by weapons on this map. Alright. Uh, uh, MP5 is now pack a punched. Now good. Anyways, uh, let's go and swap out the AK-74 FE2. <laughs> what a gun. Uh, let's see what gun we get from the mystery box. Executioner. Interesting. It's not a bad gun to get first, off the bat, but at least we didn't get any war by weapons. I don't think we can get any war by weapons from the mystery box. Wait, can we? I have no idea. But let's go and pack a punch the Executioner. Which turns into the voice of justice, I'm pretty sure, if my memory serves me right. We need a cross executioner off the list. Yep, cross off the list. Let's go. Yep, it turns into the voice of justice. Let's go. Now, this gun is absolutely just. This is good. This is a one shot. Die. <laughs> oh, what a gun. Anyways. Uh, back to doing what we're doing, and yeah. I have no idea on how many guns we've pack a punch, but I can tell you that we still have a lot more guns to go. Yeah, no, we're dead. We're dead. We're dead. There's no way. My brain is about to explode. We still need to pack a punch 27 guns. That's fun. But at least we pack a punch all the war by guns. That's good. We've also pack a punch to Executioner, which is good. Actually, that was to scrap this. Shing. Oh, you can attach it to the ballistics? What? Kind of, kind of like a chill like gameplay. I feel like nothing too bad, nothing too fast paced. I do hope everyone. I do, I do hope everyone is enjoying the video at, at the moment. Please be fucking pack a punch on every three days, Holly. Please be pack a punch. Pack a punch. Yay! We have pack a punch the ballistas. Uh, we have successfully pack a punch the ballistas. Now let's pack a punch the um, hammer. Now we can hit the mystery box again and yeah, get a bet, get a, get a different gun. I still can't believe that it doesn't do it doesn't do more damage. I was really hoping that it did more damage. Oh, yeah, that's right. I completely forgot. Um, yeah, you can put the bow knife onto the ballistas. I literally found that out while. Um, Getting up to round 15, waiting for pack a punch. Uh, the M27 and the RPG. Not bad, not too bad of a gun. So let's go pack a punch both of them, and then we can uh, cross both of those off the list as well. Yeah, it's taken me a very long time to get pack a punch again. I don't know why it's always the last thing that I get on this map. Usually, when I play this map, 
It's usually the second thing that I get, but for some reason, while doing uh, the pack a punch in every single gun challenge, it isn't. M27 is now pack a punch, now the RPG, and RPG is now pack a punched. That is four guns pack a punched, which is pretty good. And the M27 is actually not bad. And the RPG, this is why I like the gun. Because of that. <laughs> it just, it's just so just stupid. Whatever dev decides to make the RPG automatic, I love you. <laughs> I know I've said that in the past, but it's just such a good gun. Uh, it's really easy to knock yourself down, uh, knock yourself with. That's why I barely use it. Oh my god, I literally just nearly died yet again. Holy shit. A lot of people think the M27 is the best gun in the game. I beg to differ. The RPG. Your automatic RPG is way better. And then we can go and uh, hit, the mystery, hit the mystery box and go and pack a punch. Really good. Uh, that's the last zombie. Let's go and hit the mystery box, which is over here. Now, I wonder what gun we will get. I hope we don't get any repeats, because that's going to suck. If we get any repeats. LSAT, interesting. Now, this is one of the DLC weapons that we have not pack a punched on this channel yet, I think. So... That's fun. Oh yeah, and also the M27 is also a DSL, DS, uh, DSL, D, D, DLC weapon. <laughs> I, goddamn, I'm dyslexic. Um, now, the Elsa is one of the best guns in the game. Uh, pack a punched, so that's fun. Yeah, but we've got two of the DLC weapons done. Because I'm pretty sure the M27 is literally a um, Nuketown exclusive, so... That's probably why people love this map, because it has one of the best guns in the game. Now, I love the fact that, like, maps have, like, exclusive weapons. Like, Buried has the Paralyzer uh, and the Time Bomb as well. Don't, I didn't forget to, forget the Time Bomb. They also, I'm pretty sure the LSAT's only on Buried and Nuketown. Pretty sure. And also the, um, Mob of the Dead also has a uh, machine gun, which is insane, by the way. The gun is absolutely safe. And I don't know why a dev decided to add target fire on this freaking on the LSAT when it's pack a punch, but they did. It's really stupid. It, it literally covers the whole entire screen and it literally outlines the zombies. It's like aimbot. We're slowly but surely getting all the guns done. And a type 25, not bad of a gun. Uh, we're supposed to pack a punch it. Now, I really hope that they bring back some of the uh, BO2 guns. Uh, into Call of Duty Black Ops 6. I mean, they probably will do that, maybe, because they said they'll go and bring back like features from like old CODs. And I'm pretty sure the gameplay is going to be similar to Cold War gameplay. So, if if for all those Cold War lovers out there, Call of Duty Black Ops 6 is going to be basically on the same engine as uh, Cold War. So, that's fun. Now, Cold War was a good game, but it was mid tier. I I liked it. If you guys want want to see me play a Cold War, let me know in the comment section down below. I will be playing Call of Duty Black Ops 4 as well, and doing like challenges on that as well. You know what the funny thing is? We have never played Call of Duty Black Ops 1. We're making better progress than we made uh, last game. What a good gun to get. What a good gun to get. Pretty early on, the war machine. Now this gun is complete dog shit. It takes three explosions just to kill one zombie. That is so stupid. Anyways, back to using this gun. Oh, holy shit. Okay, I'm back, guys. You know what's, like, really funny? Um, I've been lifting weights lately, and my arms have been getting... I, I can see the change, but no one, like, around me has seen the change. Like, I'm gonna keep on going, like, until, like, people say, like, uh, you've, you've, you've got, gotten some muscle on you. Uh, we need to grab this next gun real quick. Uh, the FAL. Let's go. We've a pack a punch the FAL. FAL successfully. Oh my god, we got a unicorn reticle. <laughs> oh, it's fucking hilarious. I didn't even know that this game had a freaking unicorn reticle. That is just absolute gold. Absolute love it, bro. <laughs> what a freaking. Nah, that's, that's, that's crazy. Anyways, let's go and uh, get our next weapon for the mystery box, shall we? Uh, spin the mystery box. Ah, we got freaking teddy bear. Yay, first ever teddy bear of the game. Wanna get up, baby, you need a little revive. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, the SMR, oh my god. <laughs> now this, the SMR is the worst gun in the game. It's a good point, though, don't get me wrong, but it's the worst gun in the game. So you'll see why in a second. 
Oh my god, smiley face? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I got a smiley face. <laughs> what the hell? We're getting the good reticles. Uh, that's, that's golden. Uh, next gun. Uh, dual wheel 5.7s. That's actually a really good gun to get. And now we just need the singular version of the 5.7 and then we're done with the 5.7s. S12 and we need a pack a bunch of S12. We haven't gotten any repeats yet, yet so that's good. Ah, S12. Pack a punch. Now we haven't gotten any of the snipers yet, which is freaking horrible. The S12 is regarded one of the worst shotguns in the game because of its ammo capacity when pack a punched. The ammo capacity is just absolute dog shit for a pack a punched weapon. Ah, uh, let's see what gun we have next. We've already pack punched through Type 25, so we've gotten one repeat. That is terrible. I mean, it's round 22, and we still haven't gone down, so that's pretty good. SMR again. We do not need that. M8A1, we need that. We need to go pack a punch it. Alright, M8A1, pack a punched. We only need to pack a punch 13 guns, guys. We've made some massive progress. <laughs> oh, we have been recording for like nearly two hours. That is ridiculous. Oh, we got another um, emoji as our reticle. That's great. The DSR 50. Interesting. Um, one of the best guns in the game. Not joking. It literally one shots. Watch this. <laughs> it's great. Oh, uh, it's in the mystery box. You know what's really surprising? We still haven't gotten the mystery. The freaking, um. What do you call it? The, um. Oh, I try and remember it. Ray guns. We haven't gotten Ray Gun Mark II or the normal Ray Gun. And we're on round 24. So. I think we're going to have to do another run to try and get the ray gun or we're going to have to use the mod medi to get the ray gun. Because if this video takes way too long and I can't get like the last remaining guns, I will have to use the mod medi to get the guns that I need to get. Okay. I'm just the king. I, 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 I quick scope with this fucking thing. See, this is why like if they were to ever add like the DSR 50 into the game, like into Call of Duty Black Ops 6, I don't think uh, people would, would play the game because... People like me, that is an absolute king at sniping. Just quick scoping everyone, and everyone will be getting pissed about it. As I said, the DSR 50 is such a good gun to have on, on a high round, because it's just one shots. Ever like ever since I pack punched this gun and started using it on a high round, I loved it. Oh, we got the Barrett. Interesting. Talking about snipers, this is the shit of sniper in the freaking game. <laughs> I'm, I, I'm sort of glad that we didn't... We, need, we, we haven't gotten that many repeats yet. Now, nah, this is why this is regarded as one of the bad guns in the game. Never mind. It, it one taps on round 24 like the DSR 50. I, I take it back. Apparently, I'm eating my own words today. Uh, okay. Uh, the M8A1, we do not need that. Let's we'll see if we can hit the mystery box again. And... Uh, no, we couldn't. Okay, cool. Okay. How the fuck am I still alive? What? Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, can I like get out of this fucking goddamn hole, please? Oh my freaking god. Nah, guys, nah, guys, no. Look. I'm not cheating. I'm not cheating. I can promise you guys I'm not a cheater. How the f did I survive that? That's just a highlight right there. How? <laughs> I'm so glad this game is buggy. What the frickity frack, bro? That is insane. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Okay, uh, we need to uh, hit the mystery box right now and get a gun. <laughs> no way he survived that, bro. Oh, how the fuck did we not get hit there? We are having so many close encounters. You have no idea. Holy shit. Ray gun! Yes! <laughs> uh, now, when, when you have the ray gun, you cannot get the ray gun mark too, so we will have to swap this out. I don't know why they made it a thing that you can't have both ray guns in your inventory, but you just can't. I'm so surprised the non-packed ray gun is actually killing on round freaking 26. And I still, like, like to mention on how to f we survived that like in there bro how <laughs> it's back a bunch just ray gun the ray gun is now officially crossed out let's keep on hitting the mystery box okay we it turns out we've already pack a punched one of the guns that were on the list so i've already crossed it out 
Uh, we've already packed a punch GM to 3R. I don't know why we didn't cross it off the list, but we didn't. But we just crossed it off the list, so we don't really have to worry about it anymore. So we're going to be pack punching two guns, then we're going to have 10,000, then we're going to spin the box a couple more times to see if we can get another gun that we haven't pack a punched yet. Right, the M tire is pack a punch, and this gun's pack has been pack a punched. So we should cross the M tire off the list now, since it is done. Uh, we finally got the cap 40, let's go. Oh, no idea on how long this is taking me. And then we just need the Python, Shitcom, and Galil, and RPD, and the Rega Mark II. Not bad. We've only got five guns to go. God! I really don't want to talk about it. I really don't. This That was just such bullshit. On, on dis different levels. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Oh, you guys may have heard something break. It definitely wasn't my controller. <laughs> Please give me a gun. RPD. Yes, we got a gun that we haven't pack punched yet. Thank the Lord. I, I'm going insane. Please be packed. Everything that is holy, please be packed. Pack a punch. Yes, we have pack a punch for RPD. Honestly, I bloody give up. I, I just can't. Uh, the Galil. We haven't pack a punch the Galil. Uh, let's pack a punch the Galil. Pack a punch. The Galil is now pack a punched. Uh, the Rega Mark II is now pack a punched. The Python is now pack a punched. And the Shitcom is now pack a punched. We have now pack a punched every single gun that this map has to offer. Uh, if you guys have enjoyed this video, please make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. 